Welcome back to Get Connected. I'm your host, Con Jackson. Joining us right now live is one of the top interior designers in the world. You might remember from Queer Eye from the Straight Guy. Well, we've interviewed Carson from the show. We've interviewed Ted Allen from the show. And now it's my pleasure to welcome the amazing Tom Felicia. Welcome, Tom. Well, thank you. Is this Con? Well, yes, indeed. I am here, and I'm excited to hear about your summer tips that are going to make our interiors look good. Okay, so I wanted to talk to you a little bit today about brightening up your home, uh, you know, and, and in a green way for summer, now that summer, you know, now that we're enjoying summer. So um, my the, the thing I wanted to talk to you about were my three R's, which are refinish, repurpose, and recycle. Um, and let's start with refinish. You know, the idea of refinishing a piece of furniture can be a little daunting. It's not that easy. You know, sometimes we all have that piece of furniture that needs a little help or something that's been relegated to the garage. So get that piece, rather than refinishing it, just put a really great coat of low VOC paint on it in a great color, a really fun fresh pop of color, or in a, just a really fresh white, and it will instantaneously transform the piece and give it a whole new lease on life. Um, and it's environmentally friendly. So that's a really easy and simple way to sort of give a piece, you know, a whole new zip. Um, let's also talk about repurpose. So this is a vintage wine bottle that this is actually a lamp from my house. This is a vintage wine bottle that I've repurposed as a lamp. I had it electrified with a silk cord and had this twine lampshade made for it, which is really cool. And I made, you know, sort of this is my, 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 uh, my, you know, green, uh, lamp, if you will, and it actually is green. But uh, you know, we all love our environmentally friendly light bulbs. However, there's so many different types of them out there, and my favorite one is the Sylvania Halogen Super Super Saver. And the reason I love it is that it has a traditional light bulb shape. It's not the curly Q one. It gives off a really great quality of light. It's not the white fluorescent light. It gives off a really nice warm glow, which is really great. And it's affordable. Um, they uses l it uses uh, less energy than a traditional light bulb. It uses about 20 to 30 percent less energy than a, a traditional light bulb. It's dimmable, warm light. They're affordable. These are really great. Sylvania halogen super savers. Love these. Well, Tom, first of all, the light looks great, and I love that tip. But let's go back to the wine bottle, my brother. I'm telling you, there must be some great memories yeah. if you drank that whole thing. Well, <laughs> there are some specially mem some special memories from this wine bottle here. Some of them I can't remember. <laughs> no, but the, no, the, the, this is really a, it's a it's a, a vintage French wine uh, wine jug that I just I found and uh, turned into a into a lamp. It was really fun. Um, and it's kind of, you, you know, we're talking about recycling. So recycling is, th this is a great rug that I've actually designed in front of me that is made out of 100% recycled water bottles. And this is an indoor-outdoor rug that, um, that is, comes in great colors. It's a lot of fun, really great, fun, fresh way to, you know, to, to, uh, to bring that pop of summer into your house. Or with this, you can actually use it out on your deck or in a screen porch because it is indoor outdoor and it's a really great smart way to bring a recycled product you know into your home so those are sort of my three R's well Tom there's one thing you do is you make interior design look simple and we want to thank you for your three R's today and as we wrap things up tell us about your new book well I do I'm working on a new book right now you know I have a book out right now that's called uh, that's called Tom Felicia style that's you know that's still out and I have another book that's coming out in about uh, about a little bit less than a year um, and right now the name is called Hammered and it's from Hammer to Cocktail. And the idea is that it's all about, um, uh, you know, it's about renovation, interior design, and, uh, and, and entertaining. So that's sort of the idea. Well, Tom, I look forward to that book coming out again, I think, in less than a year. As we wrap things up, given your tremendous success, what advice would you give to the rest of us living out our dreams? Uh, I would say, you know, kind of keep your eye on the ball and um, stay kind of focused on what you love to do. Um, and if you really like what you're doing, I think that it, you can organically sort of bring it to the next level um, because you can really talk about it. You're thinking about it all the time. 
your, you know, your, your, it's just become sort of a natural extension of, of sort of the way you, uh, the way you operate. So you're just constantly thinking about it and moving it forward. So for me, design is, you know, whether it's products or, or, or interiors or, or, you know, uh, television shows and, and redesigning people's homes. It, for me, it all goes back to design. So it's very organic for me to, uh, to be able to stand here and talk to you about, you know, interesting ideas or, or different concepts. And, and um, you know, I just think that if you really find what you love and stick with it. Well, there's <laughs> one thing for sure, Tom. We are all glad that you stuck with it because we get some great interior design tips and we want to thank you and continued success. Thank you, I appreciate it. Nice talking to you. If you want to learn more about Tom and his amazing ideas today, you can go to our Get Connected website at contv.com. Coming up next, do real men cook? And can you be a real man if you cook salad? We'll find out, because that's what I did.